ibuprofen, a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug, is generally considered safe for short-term use when taken as directed. However, prolonged or excessive use of ibuprofen can potentially lead to shocking liver-related issues. Now let's see what ibuprofen does to your liver. 1. Liver cirrhosis. A condition where the liver gradually becomes scarred, affecting its ability to function properly. When we talk about ibuprofen, a commonly used pain reliever, it's important to note that prolonged and excessive use of this medication can contribute to the development or worsening of liver cirrhosis. Think of ibuprofen like a tool that helps to manage pain and inflammation. However, just like any tool, it has its limitations and potential risks. When taken too frequently or in high doses, ibuprofen can cause inflammation and damage to the liver over time. This damage triggers a process where the liver tries to repair itself, but the healing results in scar tissue formation. Liver cirrhosis is concerning because it impairs the liver's ability to perform its essential functions, like filtering toxins from the blood and producing proteins necessary for bodily functions. 2. Liver necrosis, a consequence of ibuprofen toxicity, signifies the death of liver cells due to prolonged or excessive use of the medication. Ibuprofen, commonly used to alleviate pain and inflammation, can overwhelm the liver's natural defenses, resulting in cellular damage and necrosis. When liver cells die, it can lead to significant dysfunction, causing symptoms like abdominal pain, jaundice, nausea, and fatigue. These signs indicate that the liver's ability to detoxify the body and produce essential proteins is compromised. Recognizing liver necrosis is crucial for seeking timely medical intervention to prevent further harm and potential liver failure. Treatment involves discontinuing ibuprofen use, managing symptoms, and implementing strategies to mitigate liver damage. 3. Hepatitis Hepatitis is a condition characterized by inflammation of the liver and one of the potential issues caused by ibuprofen. While effective at reducing pain, inflammation, and fever can sometimes lead to liver inflammation, which is the hallmark of hepatitis. The liver plays a crucial role in detoxification, metabolism, and various physiological processes within the body. When ibuprofen is metabolized in the liver, it can lead to the release of certain chemicals that trigger an inflammatory response. This inflammation can cause liver cells to become swollen and damaged, impairing the liver's ability to function properly. Hepatitis induced by ibuprofen typically presents with symptoms such as abdominal discomfort, fatigue, nausea, jaundice, yellowing of the skin and eyes, and elevated liver enzymes and blood tests. In most cases, hepatitis caused by ibuprofen is reversible upon discontinuation of the drug and with appropriate medical management. However, in severe cases or with prolonged exposure to high doses of ibuprofen, hepatitis can progress to more serious liver complications, including liver failure. 4. Portal hypertension. A condition where there's high blood pressure in the veins that carry blood from your stomach, intestines, and spleen to your liver. Although this effect is relatively rare and usually occurs in individuals with pre-existing liver conditions, Imagine your liver as a busy traffic hub, processing nutrients, medications, and toxins from your digestive system. Ibuprofen, a commonly used pain reliever, can sometimes disrupt this traffic flow. It affects the production of certain substances that help regulate blood flow in the liver. Now, here's where things get interesting. Ibuprofen, by interfering with these substances, can make the blood vessels in the liver constrict making it harder for blood to flow through. This increased resistance can cause blood pressure to rise in the veins leading to the liver, leading to what we call portal hypertension. 5. Jaundice A condition marked by the yellowing of the skin and eyes, often signaling issues with the liver. Our liver works tirelessly to filter toxins and process medications like ibuprofen. However, when ibuprofen is broken down in the liver, it can occasionally disrupt its delicate balance. 
This disruption may lead to a buildup of bilirubin, a yellow pigment formed during the breakdown of red blood cells. As bilirubin levels surge, the skin and eyes may take on a yellow hue, signaling jaundice. While it's not common for ibuprofen to cause jaundice, it's a crucial reminder of how our body systems can interact unpredictably. 6. Hepatic stetosis, also known as fatty liver disease, is a condition characterized by the accumulation of fat in the liver cells. When we take ibuprofen, the liver, our body's metabolic powerhouse, swings into action to break it down. However, sometimes this process can inadvertently lead to the buildup of fat within liver cells. The exact mechanism by which ibuprofen contributes to hepatic stetosis isn't fully understood, but it's believed to involve the disruption of normal metabolic processes in the liver. This disruption can lead to an imbalance in fat metabolism, causing fat to accumulate within liver cells over time. Hepatic steatosis isn't always symptomatic, but it can progress to more serious liver conditions if left unchecked. 7. Liver failure. It occurs when the liver can't do its job properly, and ibuprofen can sometimes play a role in this scenario, especially if taken in excessive amounts. When you pop ibuprofen pills, your liver steps in to break it down. However, too much ibuprofen overwhelms the liver's capacity to handle it efficiently. As a result, ibuprofen and its byproducts can start damaging liver cells, leading to inflammation and, in extreme cases, liver failure. The signs of liver failure caused by ibuprofen can be alarming. Yellowing of the skin and eyes, stomach pain, nausea, and even confusion. That's why it's crucial to be mindful of how much ibuprofen you're taking and to seek help if you suspect an overdose. 8. Elevated liver enzymes. Picture your liver as a vigilant gatekeeper, constantly monitoring and filtering everything that enters your body. When you take ibuprofen, this vigilant gatekeeper, your liver, springs into action to process it. However, sometimes ibuprofen can cause a bit of stress to our liver cells. As a response to this stress, certain enzymes normally contained within liver cells can leak into the bloodstream. These enzymes, such as ALT and AST, are like red flags that signal potential liver damage or inflammation. It's like your liver sending out an SOS signal to let you know something might be up. While elevated liver enzymes don't always spell disaster, they're essential warning signs that shouldn't be ignored. 9. Cholestasis A condition that affects how bile flows from the liver. Think of bile as a help to digest fats and keep your digestive system running smoothly. Now, when you take ibuprofen, sometimes it can face a bit of a roadblock. Ibuprofen, while effective at relieving pain, can occasionally disrupt the flow of bile from your liver. This disruption can lead to a buildup of bile acids in your liver and bloodstream, causing symptoms like jaundice, itching, and changes in urine and stool color. It's like your body's alarm system signaling that something isn't quite right. 10. Liver toxicity. Serious concern associated with the prolonged or excessive use of ibuprofen. When ibuprofen is metabolized in the liver, it undergoes various chemical reactions that produce byproducts. If the dosage is too high or if the drug is taken for an extended period, these byproducts can accumulate, placing a strain on the liver's detoxification capacity. This excessive load can lead to liver toxicity, causing inflammation and damage to liver cells. Liver toxicity from ibuprofen may present with symptoms such as nausea, abdominal pain, jaundice, and changes in liver enzyme levels. In severe cases, it can progress to acute liver failure, a life-threatening condition requiring urgent medical intervention. To mitigate the risk of liver toxicity, it is crucial to adhere to recommended ibuprofen dosages, avoid prolonged use without medical supervision, and be vigilant for any signs of liver distress. 11. Hepatic ischemia, where the liver doesn't receive enough blood flow to function properly. While hepatic ischemia isn't directly caused by ibuprofen, it's essential to understand 
how certain factors related to ibuprofen use can indirectly affect liver blood flow. Imagine your liver as a bustling city with a complex network of roads and highways transporting essential nutrients and oxygen. Now, ibuprofen, like many medications, can influence the traffic in the city by affecting the production of substances called prostaglandins, which regulate blood vessel size. When prostaglandin levels drop due to ibuprofen use, blood vessels in the liver can constrict, reducing blood flow to this vital organ. Additionally, Ibuprofen can sometimes cause gastrointestinal ulcers or bleeding, leading to a decrease in blood volume and further compromising liver blood flow. 12. Liver damage. Prolonged or excessive use of ibuprofen can lead to liver inflammation, hepatotoxicity, and even liver failure in severe cases. Liver damage caused by ibuprofen may manifest with symptoms such as abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, fatigue, jaundice, and elevated liver enzymes in blood tests. In some instances, the damage can progress rapidly, leading to acute liver failure, a life-threatening condition requiring immediate medical attention. To minimize the risk of liver damage, it's essential to use ibuprofen cautiously and adhere to recommended dosages and durations. 13. Fulminant Hepatitis an acute and severe form of liver inflammation and damage that can occur due to various factors, including medication overdose, viral infections, or autoimmune reactions. While ibuprofen is not typically associated with causing fulminant hepatitis, there have been rare cases reported where ibuprofen overdose or hypersensitivity reactions may contribute to this serious condition. Fulminant hepatitis is characterized by rapid and extensive liver cell destruction, leading to a sudden and severe impairment of liver function. Symptoms may include jaundice, abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, confusion, and in severe cases, hepatic encephalopathy, which is a brain dysfunction due to liver failure. It's important to use ibuprofen cautiously following recommended dosages and durations, and to consult a healthcare professional if you have concerns about liver health or experience any symptoms of liver problems while taking ibuprofen.